Thanks, Regina. Well, for the past few months, we've been asking our viewers at home to tell us what they are doing to make our neighborhoods a little greener as part of our Eye on the Environment contest. We've selected three finalists, and we've been introducing you to them all month long. Our last contestants are students at George Fisher Middle School, where kids in the Go Green Club have joined together with one thing in mind, protecting our planet. C to the A to the K to the E, take that trash away. The Go Green Club at George Fisher Middle School in Carmel, New York, has become contagious in the community. With students, faculty, and parents reducing, reusing, and recycling, all hands are on deck when it comes to protecting our planet. The earth is in global warming. More people need to recycle. If the entire world recycled, our world would be a better place and we'd hopefully stop global warming. Seventh grader Alec Vasi is the brainchild of the Go Green movement. The club is taking action to help the community become more environmentally aware by distributing reusable water bottles, encouraging recycling, initiating a highway cleanup, and going paperless. They hope these projects will not only care for their neighborhoods, but eventually the world. This has gone beyond where any of us thought it would, and you could, I'm sure you can see when you spoke to students, we weren't there. It's their passion of, of making this just grow and, and their commitment to uh, recycling. The Go Green kids have reached far beyond the environment and into the lives of the sick with their recycling efforts. With Project Chemo, students are able to collect water bottle caps and donate them to Mount Sinai Hospital, where the money is put towards chemotherapy treatments for the terminally ill. We don't want the people to struggle and have to pay all the money for the chemotherapy. So by collecting the bottle caps and sending it to their hospital, it'll donate to um, get money for the chemo treatment. At George Fisher Middle School, saving the planet is a part of school every day. The students in Go Green started educating and improving their own habits and then spread the word to their families and their school. But their ultimate goal is to change the world. They are the generation that is coming up with this, all of these ideas. And they're the ones who are learning how much damage was done. And they're the ones who are going to take this information and carry it when we aren't around anymore. And now that we've shown you the top three finalists in our Eye on the Environment contest, it's time for you at home to help us pick a winner. The voting starts right now, and all you have to do is log on to our website at rnntv.com to cast your vote. There you can check out all of the finalist segments and then vote for your favorite one. Voting lasts until midnight on Wednesday, May 5th, and we will announce our winner during Richard French Live on May 6th. So to all of our contestants, thanks for participating and good luck. Regina?